As we begin to look at what we want, as we begin to look toward the future, what's going to be crucial for you is every time you find yourself saying that you can't do something, you've got to affirm to yourself, hey, hey, no, 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 I can make it. This can happen for me. But you've got powers within you, talents within you that you haven't even reached for yet. Now, whatever goal you have, here's what we know. You're going to have some opposition. You're going to have some difficulties. You're going to have some challenges. Long journey, long dark night. But when you hold on to your dream, don't let anybody kill it in you. Just hold on to that dream. When it doesn't make sense to anybody, including you sometimes, just hold on. Once you give yourself an opportunity to try and to stretch, you'll find out you can do more than you can ever begin to imagine. The first level to success in life, the very first level, is you seeing it. Like it's clear to you. You know exactly what you want. You know exactly when you want it. You know exactly what it tastes like. You know what it look like. Before you really blow up, blow up, and you get success, you literally have it in the palm of your hand without having it. What does your dream look like? What does it smell like? What does it taste like? The problem with some of y'all is you want somebody else to support your dream. It's yours. I don't owe you a dime. It's your dream. If you want it to happen, get your butt up and make it happen. If you want it to happen, rise and grind. I ain't put my dream on nobody else, and I don't care what nobody think about my doggone dream. This is my time. This is my moment. Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. Ain't no such thing as tomorrow. We only got today. It's necessary that you be patient. It's necessary that you take a stand. That you dig in. It's necessary to know there are going to be some difficult times. I know I'm going to have to take some blows. Find out how strong I am. Can I stand up? I know I'm going to experience some rejection and disappointment. I know there are going to be some hard decisions to make. The things are going to be so uncertain that I'm going to feel overwhelmed and feel like I can't handle it. I know, I know I'm going to experience all of that. Why? It's necessary. It's a part of life. It's called life. All of that will create you to a certain kind of person. That as you go through that experience, what you become in the process, that you'll discover a part of you that, that you did not know was there. Don't cry to give up, cry to keep going. Don't cry to quit. You already in pain, you already hurt, get a reward from it. Don't go to sleep until you succeed. It's about heart. You gotta have heart. Pain is temporary. It may last for a minute, or an hour, or a day, or even a year. But eventually, it will subside. And something else will take its place. If I quit, however, it will last forever. I dare you to take a little pain. I dare you. I dare you not to go home. Somebody said, I don't go home, I feel bad. Go, go through it. You ain't gonna die. At the end of pain is success. You may ask yourself, what is a champion? Someone who pushes beyond their competitors. Someone who doesn't limit their success. A champion always asks themselves, how can I improve myself? How can I become faster? How can I become stronger? A champion tells himself, your limitation is only your imagination. A champion tells himself, push yourself because no one else is going to do it for you. A champion tells himself, success doesn't just find you, you have to go out and get it. A champion tells himself, the harder you work for something, the greater you'll feel when you achieve it. A champion tells himself, don't stop when you're tired, stop when you're done.